Hello everybody, Peter of England here, standing in, in France on the barricades with the Gilets Jaunes movement. As you can see behind, we have uh, France's finest, the gendarmerie, who are here to keep uh, law and order in, in the, these regions. What we have all over France is uh, the Gilets Jaunes movement is blockading all the on and off ramps, uh, all the uh, ramps to exit and uh, to join the motorway on the principal routes through France, so from Marseille through Lyon, uh, Nice, Cannes, uh, Toulon, Toulouse, uh, it's the same picture. Um, so these people are coming out with a desire to change uh, the government. Their main cry or call is for Macron to resign or step down. The only problem I see is that though they know what they want, uh, they don't know what they really need as a replacement. So one part or a fundamental part of this movement is that they want out of the European Union. They want out of this false democratic uh, criminal corporatocracy that has been foisted on them, particularly by the European Central Bank. So when they're protesting against tax, they're t protesting in effect against austerity measures. When they're protesting uh, about not having enough money, it's all due to banking. So this is a, a struggle for power, and all that money is, is a form of power. So ultimately, it's all coming down to finances and money. These people don't have what they want, they don't have enough to live on, and what we find is that the European Central Bank increases its quantitative easing. It increases and maintains its asset purchase program. And what this does is it gives billions to the corporatocracy, to the wealthy, to the rich, but at the same time, it impoverishes the poor. So what we've had globally happen, uh, and this has been brought about since the end of the Second World War from 1950, that the, the Democratic Party in the United States, in effect, has merged with world communism and what we have is a movement, a political elite that have infected the entire world and are bringing the same program everywhere. So, whether it's in Holland, whether it's in Ireland, whether it's in England or Belgium or Spain or Portugal or France, Australia, New Zealand, India, it's the same thing, it's the same porridge, it's the same diet, and people have had enough. And as I said on a previous video, it is no coincidence that the plan that is seemingly coming out of the United States with a movement to change everything that is, uh, is corrupt um, is also moving into Europe. And we have three major politicians, May, Merkel and Macron, who are all soon to be unseated. In effect, these are dead people walking. Um, it's not a coincidence that this is happening, and so what's got to happen is that the momentum has got to be maintained, and I'm making this uh, video now so that we can look at some of the lessons and some of the successes that this Gilets Jaunes movement has got uh, and has, pro uh, has, uh, uh, has invented for what's called a creative form of dissent, and I'm going to be bringing this to the UK de toute suite or as soon as possible. So. Uh, Join ReMovement, visit the site, it's www.removement.net. Join ReMovement and together we can change for the better. Thank you.